So is this a UFO armada? Dozens of flying lights were spotted by onlookers over Wyoming. It was uh, evening towards night, cloudy sky. From what I saw from the video, there were at least 30 of them flying in formation at the same speed, very low, uh, just basically not far from the rooftops of the houses, in formation, at least 30 from what I saw. And uh, it seems that they wanted to be seen. They weren't hiding. And I think it was definitely the uh, uh, UFOs. It, the man that was taking the video says he did not believe they were drones because there, were no, there was no sound coming from them. This is on Sputnik News, today's article. According to the video's description, the person who witnessed the event said that the mysterious objects looked like some kind of craft. They moved across the sky in complete silence and in formation. So it appears that the marching into Area 51 to see them aliens, as one Facebook joke event suggests, might be unnecessary as a peculiar event, which according to the conspiracy theorists looks like a mass UFO sighting. This was recently reported in the state of Wyoming. According to the description on the Hidden Underbelly 2.0 YouTube channel, where the video is uploaded, the phenomenon observed just a few days ago, July 26, over the city of Casper. So if the eyewitness testimony presented in the description is to be believed, the objects featured in the video were not orbs, but rather like crafts. They weren't light orbs that you could see through. They were actual craft. Light. Uh, they had white light, white silvery light. And they moved in complete silence and complete formation, I, I add, because I just watched the video twice. He says, I figured if they were drones, I would have heard the propellers, but I have no idea what it was. It was a trip. This is what the eyewitness added, as quoted by the YouTube channel's owner. Meanwhile, another alleged UFO sighting was recently reported in the very doorstep of Area 51. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.